Good day everyone, and welcome to the Shadowbringers job introductions, this time featuring the warrior. The mercenaries of Final Fantasy have received significant changes this expansion, thanks to the overhauling of tanking actions. To start things off, we have the new and streamlined single target combo, starting with heavy swing and followed by maim, which no longer applies a slashing penalty. Storm's Path and Storm's Eye are now the only possible combo finishers, as Skull Sunder and Butcher's Block were deemed unfit for the new expansion. With regards to AoE actions, the increased enmity of Overpower is no longer present, making it a more appealing option for clearing multiple enemies as an off-tank. In addition, Overpower now combos into the new Mithril Tempest, dealing damage to all nearby enemies, extending the duration of Storm's Eye, and at level 74, also increasing your beast gauge. But perhaps one of the biggest changes to Warrior is the overhauling of their stances. For starters, Deliverance no longer exists, and Defiance now lives on as a simple toggle to increase enmity generation. The mitigation previously provided by Defiance is now present as the new Tank Mastery trait, starting from level 1. To accommodate this change, stance requirements across all actions were lifted, and their effects changed accordingly. Equilibrium, for instance, now only provides its healing effect, while Unchained has been outright removed, as the damage penalty of Defiance is no longer present. With regards to their offensive abilities, Inner Beast has lost its mitigation components in favor of becoming the predecessor to Falcleave, being automatically upgraded at level 54. In a similar fashion, Steel Cyclone now automatically upgrades into Decimate at level 60, streamlining a significant amount of separate actions that were previously available. The job-defining Infuriate is still present, now holding up to two charges at a time, and starting at level 72, also granting the new Nascent Chaos effect. Nascent Chaos further upgrades the next Felcleave into Inner Chaos, a powerful 900 potency attack guaranteed to be a critical direct hit, or Decimate into Chaotic Cyclone, damaging all nearby enemies for an impressive 400 base potency. This is, however, not a permanent change, and these actions will revert back to Felcleave and Decimate once Nascent Chaos is consumed. And while relatively minor, Upheaval's potency no longer scales with the warrior's current health, likely due to all the changes made to Defiance. In terms of mitigation and party utility, we have the new Raw Intuition, now reshaped into a flat 20% damage reduction and given a much shorter 20 second cooldown. However, it does share a recast time with the new Nascent Flash ability, restoring health to the warrior with every attack and half of that amount to a targeted party member while also reducing the damage they take. The abilities Vengeance, Home Gang, and Shake It Off remain largely unchanged, in addition to the Roll Action Rampart for added mitigation. On the other hand, Anticipation, Awareness, Ultimatum, and Convalescence were not so lucky, but to compensate, Thrill of Battle now also increases all healing received by 20%. Despite their overhaul, the warrior continues to be the powerhouse of tanks, fell cleaving first and asking questions later. But how do you feel about these changes? Let me know in the comments below, but until then, I hope to see you on the next job introduction.